everybody, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Mike Delicio. hello. Welcome to a live playthrough of Unforgiven. Now, first of all, if you've been waiting for 15 minutes and wondering where we've been, we've been playing for 15 minutes and not realizing that we weren't streaming. Um, but now we know that, so we're back. Well, here we are. So let's get started. We're starting all over again. Yes. I will do my amazing. It was it was the best. It was probably your best intro. Ever. I, I don't I think feel... we can top no. what just happened. In right. fact, I won, and you'll never know. No, I don't remember that. Unproven. We were in the judges. That's chambers. the name of the sequel. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. We're playing a game here called Unforgiven, the Lincoln Assassination Trial. It's a two-player game, back and forth. It's on Kickstarter right now. You can find a link to the Kickstarter in the description. But let me give you some background on the game. So, the uh, Lincoln Assassination Trial, most people know John Wilkes Booth killed Abraham Lincoln, the 16th President of the United States. John Wilkes Booth jumped on the stage, sat it, shouted, yeah, thus something happens to tyrants, the six right. emperor's tyrants. Mm -hmm. um, actually, twisted his ankle, mm -hmm. ran away, escaped for a while, they trapped him in a barn, a guy shot him through the cracks and killed him. Mm. Yeah, sad end of the story. Um, but what people don't realize is that John Wilkes Booth was actually part of a larger conspiracy. Not a, ooh, we think there was a conspiracy, but an actual real conspiracy. And many of the people in this conspiracy were to go and assassinate various people in political office. One of the two of them, I think, chickened out. Mm. Some didn't make it. One guy made it all the way to the Secretary of State, Seward, tried to stab him. They fought him off. His son fought him off. There's a bunch of people fighting the guy off. Um, they caught almost everybody mm -hmm. and had a big trial and hung them all. One of the people on trial was Mary Surratt. Mary Surratt owned the boarding house where all the conspirators met and talked. She knew John Wilkes Booth. She was also tried. She was also hung. She was tried by a military tribunal because technically the war was still going on and they decided to do military tribunal instead of having a civilian trial. There was uh, nine judges, brigadier generals and colonels and that's mm -hmm. like, and they sent her to death. Although five of them signed a letter off, you know, asking for clemency because she was a woman and young and the president Andrew Johnson said, nope, no and doubt. she hung. Mm -hmm. So we're reliving that trial. Mike, uh, since we we uh, the rules say that we pick somebody who is um, c corrupt or has mostly recent booked or all, I don't remember seeing that. Mike in the is rules. living in witness protection program. <laughs> His actual name I can't say it. Um, <laughs> but uh, so Mike is the defense. He's mm. defending this Cretan, this unfairly unfairly brought upon a young woman who has nothing but the best of intentions at all times. She clearly is innocent of all charges. This is an outrageous travesty of justice. I'm the prosecution and I'm here to make sure this woman is brought to justice. Mm. So, now, before you turn off your cameras, no, we have the cameras. Before you turn off whatever screen you're watching this right. on, you do not have to know this history. This is kind of just a, a background that mm. I like it because I, you know, I read sure. about this when I was a kid. It's interesting. But you don't have to know that to, to know the game. The game is a two-player game in which we are trying to persuade these nine jurors. There are nine jurors. We have two of them kind of on our side. Not yet. Right. But if we persuade these two guys. They're leaning our way. They'll, and we get two more. We have one more is kind of leaning our way and then three undecided judges in the middle. Jurors. If we get four of these jurors to lean our way, automatic victory. Also, we have a track here. Reasonable doubt. Reasonable doubt. If we ever get that track all the way to our side, then boom, automatic win. Mm -hmm. Other than that, after three phases of the game, whoever has more trial points, done a better job, better oratory skills, linguistical skills, and just actually, that's what he was Let's saying, just end it right solid now. Let's just evidence. End it right now. I think we all know who's solid got that evidence wrapped up. Solid evidence wins. <laughs> so... Before we get started and go over some more of the rules, we have a contest going on. Mm. Worldwide contest, two people, full copy pledge of the game. Ooh. It's funded, so you know it's going to happen. Mm -hmm. All you got to do to enter is email us at contest at dicetower.com. And in the subject line, put trial, T-R-I-A-L, and put whether you think Mary was guilty or innocent in the body. That doesn't really matter. It doesn't matter which one you say. But also put your address in case you win. It will go up today and about three or four more days after this live play goes up. And then you'll find it. We'll email you if you win. Yes. All right. So now we're ready to go through it. Yes, let's do it. Again. All <laughs> right. So 
Uh, we did some of the setup before you came in. We drafted the jurors that mm -hmm. we wanted to be uh, kind of closer to our side. We also drafted and placed some dice out here on the track. So the game takes place in three phases. In each phase, the first thing we will do is we'll draft dice. So we'll do that first, and I'll explain the other part here. So uh, we each start with five sway. Mm -hmm. So sway is kind of a, a bit of a currency in this game. So on my turn, I can choose any die in this row. But any die I go beyond the first die, I have to put a sway at. The dice will mean different things. Like this one here means logic. This one here is uh, Eyewitness. eyewitnesses. This one here is just a trial point. This is wild. That's pretty good. And this is hearsay, the worst kind of say. Um, so, you know, I'm actually okay with logic, so I'll just take that one, and that's my die for this turn. I don't know if you're okay with logic, but I, I, I'm going to bypass the hearsay right now, so I'm going to put a little bit of sway here with the jurors to draft this wild die. All right, so now that we've done that, we will re-roll a die. First, we'll roll the one from my side. <laughs> Which is some physical it's evidence. Definitely not what happened in the in the last game. Oh, look and at that! And some nationalism from Mike's side. Okay, mm -hmm. now we jump into the full phase of the game. So on a player's turn, um, and we'll have Michael first. You're gonna he's gonna draft the card. Now we notice we put these cards up here. This is phase one. Then we have phase two and three later on, mm -hmm. and they're put out this way. Mike can take a card that's pretty much not underneath another card. So there's two cards. Once that comes, we flip the cards underneath it, and more and more cards will open up. Mm -hmm. When you take a card, there are four things you can do with it. One of the things are you can add that card to your argument. But to do so, you pe must pay the cost on the card. So this card, for example, costs one physical evidence. Mike could spend his wild die to do that. Mm -hmm. If he does so, he puts his card in front of him, gives him a special ability at the top. This one here costs two sway. You just spend two sway. If he bought this one, this gives you a physical evidence, which can be used for future arguments. So Mike could take this one first, for example, and if I didn't take this card later on, Mike could simply take this card because he now has one physical evidence for finding the Whitney revolver. Mm -hmm. So there's lots of different cards here. They'll do lots of different things. We'll explain them as they pop up. Uh, so, for example, this Major General Hustler's Raid here that gives you a special ability that whenever you discard a trial card, you get an extra sway. Mm. So instead of getting two sway, get three. every time you throw one away, you get three. It's nice. It's nice. As we learned in the last game. All right. <laughs> so that's that's kind of a, a big chunk of what these cards do. Right. Another thing that you can do with a card is you can discard a card and take two sway. Unless you own Major General Hunter's Raid. Mm -hmm. Then you get three. Then you get three. Um, and then... Uh, a third thing you can do is you can persuade one of your jurors. So if you have a juror in front of you, you can persuade them. Each of them has a different cost at the bottom. So, for example, Brigadier General Abby and Howe needs logic, emotion, physical evidence, hearsay, eyewitness. He wants it all. Mm. But if I have all that, I discard a card, I'll turn him sideways to show he's on my side now, and I get the reward at the top, which is two sway or a card. No, no, sorry. Two sway for each evidence white card I have in my oh. thing. Oh, my goodness. I do declare. I, there's also these three undecided jurors in the middle, and I could try to pull them to my side. Mm -hmm. I need to, need to pay what's underneath them. This guy is influenced by emotion. This guy's influenced by logic. This guy's influenced by interest to national, or the national interest. So if I have two emotion, I could pull this guy to me. Three emotion, and if I get him all the way across, boom, he's mine. Now, does he come to you in your hand, or does he come to you already? He comes to you already, boom, wow. boom, boom, boom. Nice. Well, you're paying that much. You are paying a lot. All right. Just want to make sure. Uh, also, at the beginning of the game, we put three cards over here. These are alternate costs that you can pay to put these guys over one. And one of them is actually free. That's just how it worked out. Mm hmm but Probably Mike's first turn because we all know what Mike wants is a free lunch. Once we, this is outrageous, this, this slanderous attack on my character. Once we use it, it's out, right? It's a one, these are one time uses. Yes. Okay. So you might want to use it right away, but maybe you want to see if you can get away with waiting for a bigger cost. It's, I, a, it's a little bit of a. I shan't disagree. Push your luck situation right there. Now, dice themselves can be spent, thrown back in a bag as resources. A lot of the sides of dice are resources, but there's other uses for them. The hangman's noose, which is on some of the sides of the dice, can be spent to move it one towards you. Two hangman's noose can be spent to move it three towards you. Three can be have it move five towards you. Woo. If you pass the guy in the middle, he now comes to your side as a juror that you can now sway at the bottom. And you get it uh, when you move If past you that. drag it back past your across your line. So if I put it here, then Mike moves it two this way. Mike gets this die. 
that dies there if you ever pull the evidence back across your line. Um, we can also spend wilds to do different things. Two wilds lets you take a, a card from the discard pile and get it for free. Mm -hmm. um, three wilds lets you convince any juror in your hand or anyone on the board for free. Uh, you can also spend one die to get a sway, two sway if you're desperate, two for five, or three for eight, or an extra turn. Or, if you have three dice, you can slam them on the table and shout objective, object <laughs> objection, <laughs> which is my objective. Objective, your honor. <laughs> it's objective, your majesty. <laughs> you, and it basically cancel an opponent's action that they just took. But you are giving up three dice, three dice. to do so. Yeah. Um... You can also spend three sway to grab a die from your side. You can spend more to take something farther in. And you can spend sway to uh, re-roll a die that you have. Mm -hmm. There's some other things maybe, but we'll just do them as we go along. So we will start here with Mr. Mike. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, they're all uh, gentlemen. Probably, gentlemen of the jury, gentlemen of the jury, uh, I have some physical evidence that I would like to present. I would like to present this revolver, which clearly shows that my client had nothing to do with this horrible, horrible crime. All right. So Mike took the revolver. What does it say on the car? What is, is that the revolver that Wilkes used? It says uh, as he gets his. Spectacles. This guy can't even see! How can we trust him? Let me get my spectacles. Uh, Lewis Powell's weapon that broke during his attack at the home of Secretary of State William Seward. You, you That's right. Before, okay, yeah. so the gun broke, and I think he, mm -hmm. he actually knifed Seward, and then mm -hmm. the, I believe Seward fought back. He was convalescing at the time. Yeah. And uh, his son fought back. Okay, you guys don't care about that. All right. <laughs> and now we have new. Oh, I could take that whiskey that bottle. But I'm going to do something. Crazy. It's crazy. I'm going to throw away this guy here. Objection. Oh, I, can't, I guess I can't. <laughs> so I'm just discarding that one. Okay. And I'm going to persuade one of my own guys. I can do it right off the bat. Why? Because for this one, to persuade him, I need to, need to move this two towards you. Oh. I'll give you an inch. But that also gives me nine sway. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six. And a seven, quarter eight, of the nine. way to victory. With that nine sway, I'm instantly going to pay three to take this evidence, and I'm going to pay. That's it. I'm going to save it for later, mm. but let's put out a new evidence. Oh, more physical evidence. Boring. All right. Mm. I already have one juror who believes all it took was me to say, My you know goodness. what, Mike might have a point. Something you never, ever see anyone on social media say today. So this does not come to me now, correct? This die because it went past zero? No, no, no. Not when it starts from zero. Okay. It has to pass zero. Pass the line. Okay. Okay. Whew. All right. So now we're, we're back to the dice drafting phase? No, we're not. That's at no. the beginning of a round. We're oh. still going to do this till these are gone. Got we'll it. We'll draft dice then again once we set up the thing for trial phase two. Okay. All you've done is wave a gun around. I don't right. even know what you were saying about well, it. Well, I think I'm going to go ahead and take yeah, I knew you the would. Uh, Major General Hunter's Raid. And now when I discard a card, it gives me three sway instead of two. All right. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, indeed, sir. Hmm. So Frederick indeed. Stone there. Frederick Stone makes fact cards. Red cards cost you one less resource of your choice. Ah. That costs three sway, but that seems interesting. Because if there's one thing I'm all about, it's the facts, ma'am. <laughs> and just the facts. Just the facts, you say, huh? That's actually know. pretty good. I'm going to take that. I'm going to pay the three sway all right. to take that card. So red cards will cost me one less. Okay. I actually am not going to do anything else currently okay so if I now were to hmm mm -mm -mm. okay so if I were to spend this die oh no I think instead what I'm gonna do is I'm I, I'm all about evidence so I'm gonna spend is that two sway down there or one sway that is one sway I'm gonna spend one sway to get this 
All, all you're doing. John Wilkes Booth's knife. All he's doing is proving my point. You're like, look, a gun, a knife. So now we're going to flip that over. All right. Oh, that is, that is, that is fact. And I can take that for free, actually. Mm. And that's a red, oh, because of your red card. Yeah, because and that of, card is at the end of the game. It looks like that gives me a trial point. A, a trial point for every black card I have, which okay. I have one of. Okay. Um, that's not shabby, but you don't care about that card that much. I don't know. And I, I think I, might, I think I we're going to end this card. trial before that point. You think? I don't know. <laughs> I do because my client is innocent. Objection. I'm going to pay. I like that fingerprint thing. Clearly, the jurors are being swayed with your contemplative nature. Yeah, well, you know what you could do with your contemplative <laughs> nature? Contemplative means slow, folks. I'm going to chuck this car. No, I don't know. All right, I'm just going to take a map of Booth's escape route. Okay. And it's free, mm -hmm. and I'm just putting this into the thing to pull it this way. Um, because here's what I believe. I believe she knew about mm -hmm. Booth's escape route. In fact, she helped him, and um, she's just generally evil. Okay, so if I wanted to get this one, this would give me... For every sway I've got, I'd be able to... Oh, so that's a powder monkey? Yeah. So the powder monkey, whenever any player advances on the... the oh. and when any, either of us moves on that track, you Ooh. get a sway. Ooh, my goodness. All right. <clears throat> well, I do believe I can get this for free because I have... I thought you might, and, and I didn't mind that, but I just didn't want it to go to the four. Like this? I was setting that play up for a long time. So I, the, I only have two <laughs> dice. So three moves it five spaces. Am I correct? And it was at two? No, 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 no. Because one, two, three. I don't think you can do that. I don't think you. This is dice actions. This moves it two. I don't think you can add oh. that to that to make a third oh, dice. Oh man, action. that would be okay. That's what I was. That's what I was hoping for. But that's okay. So it was at two. I'm using this to move it two, right? And if I wanted to spend that, I could no, move it. No, it was at one. Oh, it was at one. Because I just moved it okay. one back so because of that. So now it moves two, and I'm going to spend this to move it one more. Which now gives you Brigadier General Robert Foster. Just two here, though, right? Two roads Not, appeared in the middle. Uh, it's a different Robert Foster. It might be. But he doesn't come to me swayed. He just, need, he just comes to my hand, correct? Yes, he does not. You have to still persuade him. All right, all right. Well, that changes the whole trial. Mm-hmm. So now this can't be used anymore, correct? Yeah, that was a one-time thing. Okay. Uh, I will double-check on that. That is a, that is um, different kinds of cards. Reasonable doubt. They just move. They just move it on the track. Okay. Man. I really am. I'm like I'm like super nervous about a lot of this, but I need to get some some resource in a play. Mm -hmm. And it seems like Judah Benjamin is cheaper than whiskey. So Judah Benjamin, I'm going to take him. He was the Confederacy second in command. He was alleged to know about the plot to kill Lincoln. Mm -hmm. All right, so that takes two sway, and that moves that and gives you two trial points. I don't have two sway, however. I could discard a card to get three sway. I think I'm going to discard this because, wait, do you want these? Nope. I don't think you really care about those all that much. So I'm going to discard this to get three sway. Yeah, this is problematic. He's moving that reasonable dad. He's going to run that into the ground. I have no idea what you're talking about. The, the facts are just as they are. I have clearly my argument could not be more clear. Hmm. Well, emotion. I know what I'll do. I'm going to chuck Lewis. 
Okay. I'm going to use this card, mm. and I'm going to move cheap. That's Lieutenant a, Colonel David a little bit closer to my side. That's a cloying attempt. Look, to all unduly. I said was, yes, shut up, <laughs> defense. <laughs> Now, wow, with such eloquent speech, I can understand why you've got the esteemed lieutenant colonel going towards your direction. All right, well. Why you? Why you, dirty rat, you? Let's see here. You still could take that powder monkey. I could take the powder monkey, which. Oh, wait, do you have, a, do you have a, any hearsay? No, 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 you don't. But you could buy one. I could. So this basically, I could buy one. <clears throat> and this would give me, would move it. Oh, uh, that moves it. That moves it. No, when anyone moves, when anybody you advances on that track, you get a sway. You get a sway. Okay. Um, I got rid of the dangerous one. I'm out of the sway mm -hmm. zone for now. Out of the sway zone. Okay, so let's see. Are you this? Uh, but I've convinced one juror. I'm not sure you've done nothing. No, I don't think that's true at all. I think what I want to do is get a couple of sway. Spend a couple of sway. I'm going to bring. The assassin's calling card into my array. What is here. this? It actually just says I am an assassin. No, he just let. He wrote these words. Don't. Something to something something. Are you at home? John Wilkes Booth. Don't mm. wish to disturb you. Are you at home? <laughs> mm -hmm. He wrote this to Vice President Johnson. Yes. Don't want to. Don't want to bother you, but. Uh, you have a gun, but I have a bullet. I could get that bullet. That's some physical evidence. I'm kind of going for like a, a sweep here, but I do like Lincoln's hearse. Uh, Edmund Spangler, what does he do? I bet it looks like you can spend two to get one of your choice. Hmm. Uh, boy. Man, there's a lot of good choices here. Mm-hmm. I just need some logic. I need something to oh, persuade you need these logic. people. Well, let me tell you, you need logic in a real strong way. I don't think I want to give you any more choices, so I'm just going to simply pay one here, say. One sway. One sway to take a bullet. Okay. Oh. This is the bullet that killed President Lincoln. Taking a bullet, now, huh? we can stack the cards oh, like this because idea. it doesn't matter. That's a good idea. You only need to see Oops. the resource that they have. Uh, anyone here lose their glasses? Anyone? Perhaps. Hey, weren't you the person there today asking about where your glasses were when they were on Look, your face? Look, I thought that that was in confidence, sir. <laughs> I may very well have been wearing... Am I wearing... right, Roy? Was he, like, wearing his glasses looking for them? Where are they? Objection! I can't find them anywhere. And they're like, here. Look, I'm not used to wearing glasses. My whole life I went without wearing glasses, and now all of a sudden it's a Yeah, you know, some of us, we had to wear world. glasses our whole life. I'm aware we of that. We made fun of in the 80s. No one I makes fun of people for glasses now. I didn't make fun of anybody. I'm innocent, I tell you. All right. I'm going to, um, I'm going to, uh, oh, boy, I do like that card, but I don't know that I want to give you choice. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this one to take three sway. Yeah, I'm not liking that special card you have. I love it. At all. I'm going to pay three and take this physical evidence into my hand. Okay. Okay. Oh, my word. All right. I think. No, no, no. That was my extra. Oh, that's action. right. That's yeah. right. That was your extra. I do have that and that, so the powder monkey is mine. Mm. All right. Well, that helps you because you know that I've got so much reasonable doubt. This woman has clearly been unjustly <laughs> accused. Oh, wait, I'm of sorry. This it's just supposed to be one loud guffaw. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good guffaw. It's hard to do a good guffaw anymore. Um, all right. So. Let's see, I can take three, I can spend three to take this, and it's gonna give me one sway right back. And so now I have, do I have what I need? Mm, boom, some emotion. Boom, boom. Oh, not quite, but I will in a moment. All right, I'm going to, mm, 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 mm. I'm going to yeah. discard all right, I don't like giving Whatever you Whatever you do, you're opening up I know. options for I'm gonna me. Discard that to get three sway. Keep doing that. Ah, those are fine. Oh, logic. I really want that logic. A lot. 
So you've got those three dice right now? I do. Mm. That logic is good. That's a carrot. That's a gray card. That's just kind of what you took there. Yeah. Gray cards are um, appeals. They give resources for convincing juries. Yeah. Um, yeah, logic is good. Although the knife is useful. What do I need for this guy? I got hearsay, evidence. I need an eyeball. None out there. Oh, there's an eyeball there, though. Mm-hmm. No, I'm paying three. I need that logic. Look, I wish I could argue about your desperate need for logic, but I can't argue, so I won't. All right, so now I think what I'm going to do at this point... Open up more cards for me. I'm going to persuade an open juror. How so? I need nationalism. I need a physical evidence. Yeah. I need hearsay. Got it. I need eyewitness, and I need four... I do need to discard a card still to do so, correct? Yes. All right, so let's discard. Did you just throw Sway in the bag? I sure did. <laughs> uh, <laughs> discard that. It is a, it is a chore yeah. to play a game with an old person. Look, you might say old. I say seasoned. I'm seasoned. Hi. And now I've also got a wild. I've got that anything is, I want. That's pretty awesome. I, mm -hmm. I, I think I gave that one to you. I just didn't think I could draft him so easily. Mm -hmm. What did you open up for me? James Gordon Bennett. It mm -hmm. looks like... Yeah, both of these have interesting... I can take a die without placing Sway on any dice you skip, but then I skip my home next turn. Oh, man, that's rough. What's this one? Uh, Colonel Baker. Um, at the beginning of each phase, you can take an extra die after each person. So that would give you two more dice if you take him. Right. For him, you need logic, hearsay, and... that Man, that, not having that eyeball is killing me. Yeah. Open up some things for me. You know you want to open up some things for me. Logic, hearsay, and I just don't have the eyeball. All you need to do is bring it like five your way, and you can get that one right there. I could take a die. Not have to do that. If there was a wild out there, I would do that. Mm. This one means spend two sway and you get, and and you get one of those. Is that right? Okay. Two sway. I'm taking that baby. Woo! Love that card. Oh, you have that. Yeah, I've got logic here. I should have thrown that one. I've got. Uh, oh wait, maybe I don't. Maybe I don't have that. Oh, because I don't have. Oh, man, I was all excited. I thought I did. It's a good thing that I'm here to just fact check. Let Mike. me make sure there's no way I can get that card. I don't think there is. Um, no, because I've got eyewitness, but I don't have those two. If I had one of those two, I'd be okay. Ah, all right. Then I'm probably going to discard it because I don't want you to have it. And then I want you to take that and open it for me. So I'll take three sway. I was so yeah. excited about that. That would have been nice. I would have liked having an extra die. Yeah, that's annoying. I don't. I don't even have enough sway to take you that guy. Although I could, I could discard all three of these for an eight sway. I'm just saying. Yeah, well, do it. I don't, don't want to do it. Your reticence is showing to the jurors a, a sign of weakness and perhaps not being too sure about the argument that you have in front of you. You, you have a, a weak argument, if I might say so. You talk a lot. All right, I'm going to throw away this logic mm -hmm. by using it, oh. plus <laughs> this logic here to slide this guy down mm -hmm. one and chucking this card to do so. Throwing away logic, a truer words have never been spoken. Well, basically, look, this is what we're saying. Mm -hmm. It was the, the house that Books was saying in, she was there all the time, and we know that she listened to everything. She obviously knew about the plot to kill Lincoln, therefore mm -hmm. we must prosecute. If it's cute, you must, <laughs> doesn't work. <laughs> I'll come up with a phrase by the time this trial's over. All right, so I think, I think what's, what, what would that give you? 
That would give you a trial point for every of a particular type of card, right? Yeah, headlines. I'm not worried about tri trial points because this, this trial is not going to a conclusion. I'm going to take this because I've got that. I'm going to move this one more towards me. And this Which also I believe gets me one of these, yeah. But that also gives me one of these, right? Hearsay, yep. Okay. But that costs you a gun, but you have the gun. I have the gun right there. All right. Do I want Lincoln's chair? It's free. It gives me a trial point for every red card. But that opens up the Navy Yard Bridge for you, so no. I'm just going to take those headlines. Okay. I'm also going to pay three sway to take a, a another gun. Okay. Um, the headlines here. So I get a trial point for every headline at the end of the game. Okay. Well, I think I know exactly. Oh. Oh. Oh, we didn't replace this. No, we didn't. Because you might want to pay a pile of sway to take it. <laughs> I don't have enough, but that would be fun. Now, this is interesting. Oh, no, because you can. Okay. All right. All right. Well, I think. No matter what you do, I'm in a good mood. Well, that's fine. I'm, I'm, feeling, I'm feeling pretty good about it myself, actually. Um, heart. Logic. Ooh. Oof. All right, so I think what I'm going to do is spend three sway to take this. All right, I have two left. Um, and I will then discard this for... Mm, yeah, no, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to discard this to move him back towards me because I can spend this and I have that to do that. Got it. Use the emotion. He's like, oh, look at her. I appeal could to she emotion. I've done that. I'm like, garbage. I could object right now to you that. You do it. I don't want to waste my objection. No, you don't. Remember how early you said you were happy with, any, with whatever happens? I'm happy right I'm now. I'm actually going to spend a die on my turn to take... Two sway, that's garbage. I like it. I'm gonna spend two dice to get five Ooh. sway. Ooh! Somebody wants that noose. No, somebody wants that <laughs> noose. <laughs> yeah, I figured. So I pay one plus the ear to move it two towards me, and when anyone plays this, I get a sway mm. back. I'll spend three sway to take this, but just hanging on to it. Ah, wow. Woo! That was a lot of, uh... All right. Well, I do believe that I've got no options. I can take this and just put it in front of me, or I can take it for the sway, because I've got the heart and the eyeball. This is what? It gives me two logic points per dice I have at the end of the, at the, uh, end of the trial, if it, won't, if it goes to that. Is that correct? Hmm? This would give me two trial points per dice I have at the end of the uh, game if it goes to that. Is that correct? Yeah, uh, that's, uh, what's her name? Loose. Yeah, two for each of your unused trial dice. I think instead I'm going to get rid of it for three sway. All right. So that's the end of the phase. That's phase one. We're mm -hmm. going to do the same thing here. Uh, whoever has the justice marker farthest away from them will decide who plays first. So I'll decide who plays first. Okay. And we'll select a single die again mm -hmm. and go. So here we're going to have some I'm sure the cards get more expensive. I would think so, yes. Oh, Captain, my Captain. Man, I don't... I had to memorize that poem. Did you really? And I cannot remember... Oh, Captain, my Captain. Oh, man, I can't remember I, it anymore. I never, but, thankfully, never had to memorize that poem. Well, some of us are appreciative of the education we had. Some of us know better. Well, some of us don't have any education to appreciate. <laughs> <laughs> Woof. Yeah, look at look at all this. Woof! Look at all this. This is scary stuff. Yeah, I like it a lot. So it's in the same array, the same kind of makeup, right? All right. Woof! Oh man, I should have kept all those guns. Mm-hmm. I um, you know what? I think we do the dice first before we. Sure, but I'm gonna let you go first. Okay. Because you're going to open up something for me. I think that's a better... I mean, having Thomas... Thomas Jones ain't bad. Mm -hmm. 
I'm just going to take this one right here in front of me. I'm going to do the same. All right, first the one in front of me. I like it. Then the one in front of Mike. I'll let you roll it. All right. since. Oh, man. All right. Oh, good. Okay, hey, there's nothing wrong with trial points. Okay, so you said I'm going oh, first. Oh, I believe that's not what you said five minutes ago. There is, I'm not, I'm, this trial's not going to, to I don't, well, I don't know, we're already into phase two. All right, uh, I gotta take Thomas A. Jones here. I, I mean, that seems like a. That is a pretty good one. Okay, that is another headline that I do not have to pay the bottom part for. Mm. So because of that, I think I'm gonna take it. Oh, that's right. But I could also take the prison. Ah, oh, the prison, that's pretty expensive. It's very expensive, yeah. For one point for a blue card. I mean, that's kind of... It's two, two trial points for you right now. It is always possible that we'll get to the end and then we'll both it's be like, oh, very true. maybe I we should have went for trial yeah, points. Yeah, yeah, no, that's very true. Um, I will take the headline, though, and I have the ear, and then I have a discount of one. Okay. So I get a point per headline. I can see that these headline things are kind of... Mm -hmm. Stack yeah, up that way. I do like this, too. Yeah, but he costs four sway. He's expensive. But he he, is. he's good. He is good, though. Oh, my goodness. However, I'm just going to say this. That guy's mm -hmm. Dr. Charles Leo. Treated <laughs> Lincoln after his shot. Obviously, not the best of jobs. <laughs> he was working with substandard equipment, I think. But, uh, boy, he sure seems like that's a versatile. I'm going to do it. I'm going to pay the four sway. Whew. I'm going to take that. I Look at all, but look at all this, look at all this evidence I've got in front of me. Objection! Really? You're taking that away? You are not taking that card. Wow. Chuck it. Wow. Now, let me see how that works, because if, if you get to keep your stuff, I may not do it. Oh, would I get my, yeah, sway back? That's a good question. I feel like if I spend three dice. Yeah. Um, after your opponent takes an action, pick up any three, slam, I'm sorry, I didn't do it right. Well, hang yeah. on, I'm going to see if I want right. to do it. It's canceled. There's no effect, and anything they're spent to it are discarded. As wow. is the objection. Oh man, that was that's expensive. too powerful. That's a great card. That is a good card. Objection. I don't like that you did that. Sustained. <laughs> Thank you, Judge. Garbage. Judge. Rude. <laughs> now you don't have five sway. So Not you anymore, can't take that Derringer. So I'm going to take the Our American Cousin Playbill, and I'm going to hand those out to people and be like, look. Mm -hmm. How much sway do you have? Two. Two. Okay. Well, you can't use it either. Let's see here. I've got that. Um, yeah, I guess what I'll do is I will take... Boy, I'd, I really would have liked that card. Yes. Mm -hmm. I made a good play by accident. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Take the prison card. Huh? Well, I mean, the prison card, I don't know that I want to. First of all, I don't have, I have two guns. What about congressman? I, I, well, I may end up taking him. That guy at patriotism? You don't mm -hmm. know. That guy's probably a jerk. Taking him. Well, that opens up whatever this is. Enjoy. Colonel Henry Burnett. Nah, I don't like him. It's a lot. He's expensive, He man. is expensive. All the way around, he's expensive. I can't afford you getting this. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I, so I would have gone chucking for that for two. And then flipping these bad boys over. Give me more trial point. Give me more reasonable doubt. Reasonable doubt! Okay. Um, hmm. Too logic I'm, to I'm get sorry, you young me. man who's 13, apparently. <laughs> Reasonable doubt. <laughs> All right. Is this your first trial, Sonny? I know. It's showing. The, 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 it's showing, but. Someone wants to know what card I took from Mike. Uh, the card yeah. I took from Mike is, is basically a wild. It could be hearsay, physical evidence, or eyewitness. Yeah, and, and the way I'm playing right now, I'm really kind of going for. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do right now instead is I'm going to discard this card to sway Major General Lou Wallace. I've got logic, I've got emotion, and I've got two patriotism right there. Now this also gives me an extra turn, correct? 
Uh, yes. And that's right now? Yes. Okay. That's actually pretty cool. Yeah. So I think what I'm going to do with my extra turn is I'm going to take, do I want to take that card? It gives me two logic points for every, or two uh, trial points for every logic I have. I could take, I cannot take that card. I could take this one. Or I can just discard it for sway. Mm, how many? How much sway do you have? Uh, four. All By right, the way, for I'm those of you who are bored, discard this. During you have Mike's three sway. extremely Look, long turn. My turns have been consistently shorter than yours. Watch this move. Okay. I'm gonna pay three to buy this eyeball. I will spend this eyeball plus hearsay plus this plus this plus this to convince this dude mm. who gives me two for each white I have. I have two whites, so he gives me that four I just spent or three. Plus one. Okay. Back. I now have two jurors on my side. Okay. Now, what happens to that die? Was I, I spent it. Okay. I, I, but before I spend it, I guess. Okay. The great American hero. Uh, Oof. La, 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 but I had to. I had to get rid of a card to do that. Yes, you did. I. You have some logic. That's a good card, man. Yeah. So. All right. Well. Hmm. I feel like what I need to start doing is this. I'm going to discard this card and go like that. Oh, you got some patriotism over there. I've got a lot of patriotism, sir. Eh, we don't really care about the country. We're just here to see this woman get justice. Um, I'm not thrilled by any of this. If any of you are bored during this aspect, oh wow! Let me tell wow, you a story. Pretty. Once upon a time, there was a man <laughs> who liked to point out character flaws in others. I'm just gonna and take all the time. He should have been looking there you in go, that Mike, it's proverbial your turn. mirror. <laughs> oh, look at that! For free? Yeah, but John Wilkes Built is also free. Oh! Which one do you want? Oh, you, you know can't I have want, them both. You know I want one of. How much sway do you have? You got a I lot have. of sway. But going there, I don't know if this is going to matter at this point. I almost feel like I need to just give up on that. I really do, because I don't think that you're going to... I don't know what to tell you. They're both good cards, and if you take one, I will not be upset. You'll take, I will the, take other the other one. Right. I think right now I want the sway. That gives me a lot of sway. Sucker. I don't know, actually. <laughs> Man, that's great. You open up that, Frederick that's, Douglass, that's though. It's really interesting. Those two cards just kind of came up like that. And Frederick Douglass is a great card, too. I, I look, I got to take yeah. a booth. Because, first of all, it gives me a sway. Right. But, I mean, he knew her. He knew her. <laughs> all right. Yeah, Fred Frederick Douglass is great. Man, look at all this. Okay, so first of all, what I think I'm going to do, one, two. One, I don't have any eyewitnesses. Two, no one three. actually saw her do anything. That's the problem. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'll tell you what you're going to do. I'm going to discard Frederick Douglass because I don't want you to have it. I'm going to spend three logic, one, two, and three, plus four sway, which is going to now do that, which gives me two dice and another turn, right? Yep. Okay. Wow, that's powerful. Yep. And I now how do I, I just get the dice out of, how do I No, get, no, no, you take two dice from there without putting any, you, you can skip any dice, you can take any two dice. Whoa. Okay. If there so were some wilds out there, that'd be much more dangerous. It would be. But I as it is, I know which two you're taking. No, you don't need to do that. Oh, you just without you could just, just take, take two dice. Yeah, I figured it. To you, to I me. A, okay, so I have an extra turn now, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to discard. What does that give you? It doesn't show That's the same thing, but you lose a turn. I'm going to discard that to do this, which I've just got. I don't even have to spend these. So you win on your next turn. Correct. The winds of justice are howling through the breeze. Can you feel it? That was a strong, that was just a combo, combo, combo type thing there. That is saddening.
The tension in the courtroom is running high. Can you feel it? The electricity. <laughs> Hang on. The crowd is on uh, the edge of their seats. I am... Uh, Oh man, I don't. <laughs> I don't think I can stop you actually. Because I could buy a die, right? Re-roll it and hope for a. Oh, but you need. But oh, I yeah, need, you need two. two to bring them your way, yeah. And that's that's therein the problem. I got so caught up in the early parts of the try. Mm -hmm. Well, let's play it through. All right, buy it, re-rolling it. <laughs> Rerolling it. <laughs> Rerolling it. Rerolling it. Oh. Stupid logic. Rerolling it. Two chances. There you go. Okay, but where's the other one going to come oh, from? I don't know. I thought you might have one over there. <laughs> um. Oh, should there be a die here? Well, no, I just took that oh, die yeah. and now it's pretty but you know, It could matter if you had a. Uh, if you had yeah, if I had an extra thing. All right, I'm going to get rid of John Surratt Jr. for some more of this. And that reveals, oh, I bet you want that. <laughs> uh, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I feel like I need to appeal to your patriotism and tell you that Major General David Hunter comes to the side of the defense. Yeah, that's that, folks. So he won that way. Then that's actually pretty interesting. Mm -hmm. um, let's see what these other cards would have I'd like to see been. some of the, tri the, the Phase 3 cards as well. Yeah, so let's put them here. Uh, let's see what we got here. You can see that they Ooh. they cost a lot more. Like this guy, like, oh, there's Abraham Lincoln. Ah. So he costs three guns, and he two, needs physical events too, but he gives you two wow. towards you, and, of course, people are going to, the mm -hmm. nation. So there's all, the blue track has a lot of especially opportunity in, to in, swing. In phase three, it looks like, especially. And then there's Mary Todd Lincoln. She just gives you four. Lewis Powell, he's like a really, he was a pretty strong young man. Right. He's the guy who tried to, to take out Seward. Um, then there's points. Well, let's see. Where would we have been if, if it had gone to points right uh, for now? For points right now, I only have four, actually. I believe I also only have four. Yeah. Yeah, I was looking for another headline. I'm assuming there is... Because those headlines, I'm, right. I wonder how many headlines there are. There's one that made it nine points. I would have taken a headline had it come up. Yeah. Um, Andrew Johnson, there's he's yeah, there six, he is. and he gives six there's a lot of points, points in the final one because I guess at this point it's more likely there is Seward. That. that guy was humorless. Yeah. <laughs> I read his biography. That guy had no joy. No. Even but after buying his, he ice did box. love his country. Mm -hmm. And. Anna Surratt, that's, that's her daughter. Ah, okay. Samuel Arnold. Queen Victoria's in the game. Wow. And funny, she gives you a patriotism or a nationalism. Nationalism. Well, she sends her things, so yeah, if you yeah. can get her on your side, I suppose. The boot. There's the boarding house. Oh, there she is herself. Oh. So then that's Reasonable a lot, doubt. but it moves three that way. Interesting. The Lincoln train car. It's where they took them across America. Um... So these cards can be different. Of course, we had some cards that we didn't even yeah, see because we didn't even use those. they were over here on the side. So we have Joseph Holt and John Clampett. So you saw one of the three ways to win, mm -hmm. which was to get the four people. I didn't think that was going to happen, no, actually. I thought it was going to be here. And then when I saw that, I was like, oh, that's Mike steamrolled that. So one thing I definitely did wrong in this game is I could let Mike get too many resources. Mm -hmm. I got caught up doing this nonsense. Well, and these extra actions were big, too. That was. But having all those resources right. gave you more opportunities for cards than me. It was, just, it was just a lot of flexibility. Being able to get this first to give me a wild, you know, was helpful. I don't know that me taking this at the beginning because it put me on the negative track there. And I thought, right. oh, that's an easy one. It is an easy right. one to take. But it put you on the defensive. It really did. I was too worried that you were going to win that way. Right. Well, I thought when you did that, well, and then I thought I had that big play of moving it all the way down to like five or six. But even without that, it, made, it was something you had to think about. You couldn't just ignore that for the rest of the game now. Oh, yeah. Someone's asking about the fact that four jurors isn't enough out of nine. But five would just be too hard. Sure. So four is how you win in this game. You right. figure if you get four guys and then the, the, the some weak will guy will be like, okay, sure. Yeah, we'll go along with whatever the, the majority says at that point. So, yeah, no, it's uh, – Yeah, this is a really nice two-player game. It is, yeah. Uh, the drafting back and forth with the dice rolling and the stuff. And so hopefully that gives you an idea of how the game plays. 
Uh, you can win a copy of it um, mm -hmm. by entering our contest. We'll have it open for a few more days, so enter sooner than later. And, of course, you can go back to Kickstarter right now. Go check it out on uh, Kickstarter. We have the link in the description. That's it for now. We'll be back at 2 o'clock later today with mm -hmm. another live playthrough. So we'll see you then. Until next time, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Mike Delicio. Have fun gaming.